My name is Peter Lindemann and I'm with Tesla Chargers and today we're going to be talking about our big industrial 12 volt charger called the 24A12. Uh, this is um, the big heavy duty 12 volt charger uh, can deliver up to 30 amps uh, continuous and um, so uh, at 12 volts that's um, about 350 watts continuous. Um, this is a pretty small battery for what this is. This, this thing uh, can handle, uh, if you want to show uh, the, the big um, uh, L16s and uh, you know big solar systems, that kind of thing. Batteries l even larger than uh, golf cart type. And um, so uh, 500 amp hour and, uh, um, and above um, for this type of charger. But it's also um, safe to be used on smaller batteries and I'll, I'll show you um, how it behaves on a smaller battery so we can see again the topping event. Um, this charger has uh, a number of modes. Uh, it has uh, the standard red and green lights that uh, all of our chargers have and uh, has very similar um, activity to the uh, other chargers we've shown. But this also has um, a yellow light uh, which you don't really want to see come on, and that's the, uh, the light that indicates an overload condition. And that overload condition shows up if the charger is being asked to deliver more than 32 amperes for over two or three minutes at a time. And at that point, the overload um, system comes on to protect the circuitry of the, of the charger and also to protect the battery so that it isn't charging too fast. Um, and then it will go through a timing sequence and it will reset itself uh, so that the, uh, it'll give you a chance um, to change the conditions of the charge so that the charging rate is slower uh, and lower and uh, it'll give the battery a, a chance to cool off a bit. So um, what I want to do is I want to demonstrate uh, this charger and uh, first of all um, um, it has a, an on off switch and, um, and when you turn the power on, it uh, has its own cooling fan, which you can hear in the background. And um, it has these pretty, pretty large industrial clamps. If you, if you don't have an exercise uh, system, you can, you can use this as a double for uh, getting your hands to be stronger. But um, um, uh, this, this uh, is not a capacitor discharge machine. and. Uh, this is uh, safe um, to um, connect the outputs because it won't turn on until it senses that there's a battery there. So um, what I want to do is I want to uh, put uh, this on this battery. And um, immediately what we see is, is that the voltage uh, of the battery shows up on the meter. Okay, so this has a built-in meter. And um, I've got this um, other clamp-on meter here. This is a, uh, and it's set up in amperes, so it's going to show how many, how many, uh, how much current is moving through when I uh, turn the charger on. So the charger is then turned on um, when I flip this switch, and uh, so here's what happens. As soon as I flip it on, uh, the the red light comes on, which shows that it's charging. And again, like I said before, this battery is pretty close to fully charged um, because of what I want to demonstrate is the topping event so that you can see what happens at the end of the charge uh, so you can see what happens with the lights and the, and the full functions of the, of the charger. But we can see here that now that it's been delivering about, it's about delivering about 15 amps, 14.8 as it uh, slowly uh, drops as the voltage rises. We're down to about 14 and a half amperes. Um, so we're, we're getting up to a, a plateau here um, at uh, about 14, but it's, it continues to rise. Now this, this battery uh, charger is excellent for uh, getting the uh, highest uh, number of life cycles out of these big type of batteries for uh, solar systems and um, other electric vehicles. And um, Typically, uh, the way those batteries are treated in those um, applications 
um, they are lucky to give you two or three hundred cycles uh, before uh, the battery uh, really stops uh, being able to provide its um, full current for the day. And uh, the reason for that is, is that standard charging systems usually pretty much stop charging. We're at, we're at 14.5 right now, and that's probably pretty close to where most chargers would shut off and not let the battery chemistry um, be resolved beyond that. But um, this, uh, like all of the other uh, chargers from Energenics and the chargers that we sell through Tesla chargers, these are what we call topping chargers. These allow the voltage of the battery to be raised to um, where the chemistry of the battery can actually finish, where all the sulfate ions are out of the plates and back into the electrolyte. And that doesn't happen until you get the voltages just a little bit higher than 14.5. So um, um, this type of charger is excellent for rejuvenating or taking batteries that are, have, have uh, been chronically undercharged and bringing them back to um, full service by um, being able to top the, the chemistry. Now the battery uh, rejuvenation process uh, involves a number of, of topping charges and then discharges and topping charges and then deeper and deeper discharges until you can resolve all of the sulfation that's left in the plates. So here you can see we're up to 1476 now and, um, and we're down to about 11 amps. So we've been, we've been putting uh, power into this pretty continuously. And again, um, there's really no heat being uh, generated by the battery. And so um, we're just about up to, uh, we're about 14.8 right here. And now you can start seeing, if you come up here, you can start seeing that this green light is starting to flash, okay? So anything above about 14.8, and now the machine is starting to roll the currents off. And now you can start seeing the, the, the green light getting brighter, okay? So it's starting to flash rather fast. And so we can see that we're moving into the, um, the, the rolling off um, process. But here, let me, um, even though we're charging uh, the battery pretty, pretty strongly, um, I can show you um, that there's just almost no off-gassing. Even, even at these voltages with, this, with these high currents, there's almost no volt, there's almost no off-gassing in this battery. Uh, at the, under these conditions, so uh, this this is a completely safe process to do. So now we're above we're about 15 uh, uh, 15. We've got a good green light. We've got a good red light, and so uh, we can we can see that uh, we're still delivering eight and a quarter amps now. And uh, but we're we're uh, we're approaching a topping event here, um, and again. Uh, still no, no heat, uh, no, no significant off-gassing at voltages above 15 volts. So uh, you sure wouldn't want to do this with anybody else's charger. The dang battery would be boiling away. Um, and uh, so, so now what we just saw, we saw the transition. The red light is out, okay? Uh, and the green light is on solid, so we, it's basically saying that... Uh, uh, we're in the finishing mode, but the current meter is still telling us um, that uh, we're delivering, we're still delivering over 6 amps, but this is now in a, in a, um, a rapid pulse um, situation. Uh, so this is what we call the desulfation mode, where we're, we're giving it um, high voltage spikes to, um, to keep uh, hunting down those uh, uh, sulfate crystals in the plates. Um, but we're really not trying to push the voltage any higher than this. So you can see that the voltage is staying pretty steady at 15.24. The green light is on steady, and, uh, and now the currents are, are dropping below 5 volt, uh, amperes. So this is uh, what the finishing event looks like for any battery, and it'll do this on this battery safely. It'll do it on those batteries safely, uh, all these bigger batteries. And... Um, 
Um, so uh, this is, uh, again, this is our big industrial charger. Um, and uh, it's called the 24A12 by Energenics. And um, uh, it can be used as a, as a large scale industrial uh, rejuvenator. Uh, and if you want to learn more about the, uh, the science and art of, of uh, battery rejuvenation, just go to uh, teslachargers.com and you'll find a, a, an advertisement for a product called Battery Secrets. You can just click on that icon on the, uh, on the right column and it will take you to a, uh, a page that will tell you all about these products. There's over three hours of instruction on how to understand what's going on in batteries and how to um, use this type of topping charge uh, equipment uh, and the, the process uh, that we call battery rejuvenation uh, to uh, bring batteries back to life. So again, this is the 24A12 by Energenics. Uh, my name is Peter Lindemann and this is Tesla Chargers.